Hi, my name is Simone Stavenhuyter. I'm a designer at Philips Lighting, working with design exploration. Today we will be looking at new principles of creative lighting design. And although the focus here is for the home, we believe the same principles can be applied to professional installations. It has three parts. The first is about the reason behind the new principles, part two is about digital light effects, and the third part covers the basic principles. And you can go directly to the chapters by clicking on the links. Why new principles? On this image, you see a group of people in the evening, surrounded by the warm and colorful light of a sunset and the lively light of a campfire. The light really contributes to this special cozy atmosphere together. And today we can mimic this engaging light experience inside with digital lighting. The experience of light is subjective, personal and depends on the context and surroundings. Design guidelines, therefore, cannot be read with pure, pure logic. The aim of these lighting design principles is to give ideas and spark creativity how to play with light and its versatility to create different atmospheres. It goes beyond traditional static lighting design principles, using white light and the interaction with space and activities, but also including color dynamic lighting and the ability to express moods. Let's have a brief look now at trends in living as we move into the digital age and how digital lighting plays a meaningful role to support these trends. The trend flexible living is about our multifaceted lifestyles and new family compositions demanding multifunctional and adaptive spaces. Digital lighting support this because it's adaptive, personal and easy to control for every kind of setting, mind state and time of the day or season. The second trend is augmented living. This is about the desire to seamlessly embrace the digital world in our lives and spaces. Connected lighting can make music and video entertainment a truly immersive experience with surround colored and dynamic light in sync with the media content. And there are also a wide variety of apps for people to program the light and to connect it with other devices and data they use in their daily lives. The third trend is essential living. And that is about the growing need of people to own less and sharing and experiencing more. Light is intangible, yet creating a rich experience. Looking at home decoration, we could, for example, create a different feel in the interior by just adjusting the color of the light without having to physically change anything in the space. Finally, balanced living. That is about the need for a healthy body and mind in a busy and stressful world. Through light recipes that follows our biological rhythm or mimic natural light effects, light supports our emotional and physical well-being. So to conclude, digital lighting supports all these trends naturally. It's not only illuminating spaces, but also illuminating people's lives 